te- uh, are very focused on the technical skills but some like praneet you know uh, who are uh, who connect with people hi everyone jai hind jai bharat jai mata di welcome to my youtube channel mochane we decoded mere sath hai captain rana who is been guiding today thousands of sea farers those who want to switch from ship to shore and under his mentorship we are definitely going to help the sea faring community jo ki ship se shore pe jana chahte hain and to help them transform their lives if you have not watched the previous video please watch if you are a marine engineer where you want you can see say you want to ship ship to shore what all options do you have if you want to stay with core shipping but in this video we are going to cover the broader shipping industry so captain rana aapka bahut bahut swagat hai sir thank you very much for joining us and guiding the community out here so my question i'll repeat it once again sir a marine engineer i am a marine engineer no matter what sir rank i want to ship from ship to shore and i don't want to be connected with the core shipping because you have given me those options before and i am not interested in even one of them so tell me something i want to leverage the effect of shipping which i have served what else can i do in the broader shipping industry right uh, thanks again for having me here praneet um right so as i said earlier that the transferable skills of a marine engineer are very high and many right um and which can be utilized in many industries in different ways but over here let me move not to all the industries but a broader shipping maritime industry right so a person who has experience in shipping he wants to leverage that experience but not in the ship management domain right now he wants to uh, use that experience outside ship management domain but somewhere closely associated to ship shipping right so number 1 is shipyards right um, our vessels go for dry docks our vessel go for repairs our vessels um, are built over there um, so uh, a, a sh- um, marine engineers presence uh, expertise uh, in all of these things will be extremely extremely helpful so shipyard is one place where it can be easily right second is maritime law right now many unfortunately you know accidents happen right and when the accidents happen uh, they either start from the cargo or from the because of some machinery this thing right um you as an engineer it's not very difficult for you to learn about cargo right as a deck officer it's very difficult for a deck officer to learn about machinery the in and out of it so um when you uh, get into maritime law uh, you with your maritime expertise you can be a barrister uh, you can act as a surveyor uh, you can um, you know be in the port state um uh, for from giving a maritime law and a engineer perspective so that's one place where you can also be acting as a maritime lawyer right um number 3 which i had hinted uh, just now is port state control right in port state control you need surveys um you are on the land uh, you are guiding vessels you are checking them and so that's the third place where you could get into fourth is um port operations right i know a person um, um, a marine engineer who is um, heading north india operations of a very big liner company right um, and it, it seems a little um, difficult because generally engineers are not doing cargo operations but this person i i know him well and he is managing uh, the operations of the whole north india for a very big shipping line right uh fourth is and which is very very easily for engineers to do is technical management of uh, shore equipments right so you've got cranes uh, at the port you've got containers you've got reefer plants you've got generators uh, you've got n number of equipments so whatever you're doing over here you can on on a vessel or um, in a technical superintendent role you can actually do the same things maybe on a much bigger scale um and bring um, the kind of standardization which we have on the ship and believe me um the kind of standardization which a marine engineer brings on the vessel those standardizations are not available uh, on the shore side so so that expertise is extremely extremely good which can be used and one more 
is business development right now more most engineers are are you know te- are very focused on the technical skills but some like praneet you know uh, who are uh, who connect with people who are uh, really good to you know talk to um, they uh, can really get into the business development space uh, wherein you know you build relationships you utilize them for your company and and then you grow so that's also one space uh, and this can be in n number of uh, you know you, you, your uh, business development can be to bring business in the ship management space it can be to bring business on the chartering space it can be on the cargo space any number of spaces where a marine engineer can uh, utilize the skills okay so i'll repeat once again for all the people who are watching this video those who want to learn one is ship- shipyards but yes there are challenges because india can the shipyards i do not know how much growth is there which we'll be covering in later videos but yes agar you are ready to go to china japan korea options are more money is more we'll be covering that with captain rana in later videos second is maritime law where you can become a barrister surveyor port said i know a few people i'll be calling them as well slowly once this series with uh, captain rana is over so that we can get the insight on this as well port said control where the power lies boss you can detain a multi million dollar ship out there so yes it is their port operations very well said sir and that example that you can it really gives me a insight ki a, a marine engineer is leading a liner company's north operations technical management of shore equipment sir some of our seniors they have opened their own shipping company for technical management of shore equipments no, and the way they have done that I, i'll be calling them so it can be a job and you can even start your own entrepreneurial journey with this business development i do not know how good of how good i am at developing this but yes it says everywhere sir does ai like today we talk about ship technology we are, there is so much coming in technology does it coming to this space or does it come in outside shipping space um so um, as i said that um, in the core shipping right in the core shipping so when you are doing vessel optimization when you are doing data data management when you are ah, doing okay. um, uh, bunker management you know that's where you play with data right um, so um, and what industry requires is someone who has understanding of the shipping uh, probably technical or nautical side whatever it is and understands a little or can play with data right you can play with data through advanced excel or maybe uh, python or uh, uh, bi or or some similar tools right ai is a very big term and maybe you can start over here and then go uh, forward as well guys i'm so sorry this video was something else but just want to put it across i am very bad with technology but abhi dheere dheere when i'm talking to people who are in technology i've started loving it so who knows tomorrow main thoda sa technical bhi kuch design karu just keeping it aside all i want to say is when you want to ship from ship to shore there is always one challenge that is its salary expectations high mat rakhna challenges are there but growth jaise merchant navy once you become a chief or captain becomes constant over there here it is going like this slowly and steadily it happens and if you have a skill set required one sky is the limit with this jai hind jai bharat jai mata di let's for the next video the third video where we are going to cover what a engineer can do outside shipping in a very generic way take care bye thank you captain rana pleasure thank you hi guys jai hind jai bharat jai mata so you are a marine engineer who is thinking of transitioning from ship to shore there are a lot of options you have just seen one so if you want to do a whole detailed course where you can see sare options aapke samne in terms of course shipping what all options you have in terms of if if not course shipping outside course shipping what all options do you have outside complete shipping what all options do you have what a kind of skill set is expected from me what will be your salary this complete there is a complete free course made by us on merchant navy decoded website please go to the description box or in the comment section you will find that course which is helping today hundreds of seafarers marine engineers make well informed decisions in case you have got any query any problems you can just contact team merchant navy decoded and we'll help you jai hind jai bharat jai mata